Good morning. It's Lisa with Soul Shine. And I got up early this morning, so hence the no makeup and the power scrunchie and the air dried hair from last night, so it's a little bit frizzy. Um, not perfect this morning, but I had to meet the internet guy here at the shop, and so now I have Wi Fi. So when I get up early enough, I can come over here and do morning tea with me. It'd be kind of special. So I'm at the shop. I'm doing some last minute things for this weekend's open house. It's Friday and Saturday, 10 to 5. And um, this morning when I was making my tea to have in my to-go cup, um, I made creme caramel. And I reached into my little tea stash and I reached for the first thing that was there. And, and it was um, rainy cherries. And I was like, mm, I'm not feeling rainy cherries. So I put it back. It's a black tea. It has some caffeine. And so I wanted... Um, something that doesn't have so much caffeine. So anyway, I dug and dug and dug until I, I kept pulling out one and another and another. And then finally I found the one that I wanted. It was creme caramel and it was kind of stashed in the bottom and I could have easily settled for a thousand other delicious flavors, but that's the one that I wanted and I didn't stop and I didn't settle. And so it made me want to chat this morning about settling. So as a shop owner, I have many opportunities to settle for, um, maybe something that's not in brand or not the greatest quality or um, maybe just is straight out weird and I don't want to put it in my shop. It doesn't bring me joy. Um, and if it doesn't bring me joy, I don't feel like I can sell it well. So um, there's many opportunities as a shop owner to settle. And there's many opportunities as a wife and a mother and um, a friend to settle. So I just wanted to encourage you not to settle. I don't mean that for the big things like husbands. <laughs> don't give up on your husband. Figure out a way to make it better. But um, but the little things. Don't settle for something that's not going to bring you joy. Don't bring something into your house that you either get guilted into purchasing or um, maybe somebody else has in their house and it, it looks like it would be nice in yours and it doesn't really bring you joy. You just bought it because don't just because anything um, don't bring anything into your life that doesn't bring you joy so um, take a look at your life and your surroundings and if it's not bringing you joy if it's encouraging clutter or disarray or chaos just kind of either put it in a box somewhere in the basement or donate it to somebody else that it might bring joy to so don't settle for anything Make it a habit, uh, a mind habit, to not settle for anything. Um, I certainly did it with my tea today. It's delicious. So um, I'm off. I'm going to do a few more things at the shop, then head home and do some things at home. But I just wanted to jump on real quick since I had internet at the shop and, um, and say hello and have some morning tea with you. Um, join me tomorrow. I am not sure if I'll be at the shop or at home. You'll have to wait and see. And um, hopefully I'll have less frizzy hair tomorrow because I air dried it don't judge anyway I'm gonna jump off here and whatever you're doing today know that I'm sending you much love and I hope you have a most marvelous day love you much mwah, mwah, mwah.